Hello lovelies! On today's menu we have egusi soup recipe using the frying method. Please support me by sharing this video. Thank you and let's start cooking. For my choice of proteins I'm using goat meat, tribes and dry catfish and I will season with seasoning cubes, all purpose seasoning, blended onions and scotch bonnet pepper. I will mix to combine, cover and allow it to cook on its own juice before adding water. At this time the proteins are soft enough, I'm going to set it aside for later use. To make the egusi soup, I will go in with my palm oil, allow it to heat up. Next, I will add iru, fry for a while to release the fragrance. Next, I will go in with my egusi paste. Egusi paste is simply grounded egusi mixed with water to form a paste. <laughs> I will mix to combine and allow it to fry. I will continue stirring it now and then until it is well fried. At this time the texture has changed, that means it is well fried. Next I will go in with my blended peppers. Please add pepper to your taste. Next I will add my grounded crayfish. I will give it a good mix and add the stock as well as the proteins. I will give it a good mix again, cover and allow it to cook. The soup has been cooking for a while. Next, I will go in with my Cameroon pepper. I love the flavor in my egusi soup. I will proceed by adding my well-washed bitter leaf and my grilled mackerel fish. I will mix properly and allow it to cook for 5 minutes. If you have watched till this point, that means you love this recipe. Please support me by sharing this video. I hope you learn one or two things on today's video. Thank you for watching and see you in my next one. Bye.